Good morning! So we're on a tour of Hollywood today, we're just on the bus. <laughs> you alright? <laughs> you get used to it. <laughs> Because the film industry come to him quite a bit for scary movies and stuff like that. So he had a big backyard. So what he's done was he built the house in the backyard. He lives in the house in the backyard because he's always renting this house out to the film industry. If you look up this driveway to your left, you see a house in the back. Yep. So if she ever invites you up here to her house for a party, you can go this way when you get to the stop sign, make a left and go right inside the driveway, even though you know that ain't gonna happen right here on your left. Yeah. Disney films are premiered. That was manic but fun. So we got some stars Celine Dion, Walt, Meryl. Um, what else did we do? We saw Helen Mirren's hands, uh, Meryl's hands, Julie Andrews' hands. Uh, ran up, got a photo of the Hollywood sign, El Capitan Theatre, uh, Chinese Theatre, Kodak Theatre. It's like the main Hollywood. It's tacky, but it's cool. Not the really main Hollywood. Like we just say, we could have done with like two hours, couldn't we? Really? It's although it's tacky, but like you could have done with half an hour in the shop, half an hour walking up and down. There's a lot more we could have done. God, it's a light one. Literally any of these. had lunch in a veggie restaurant. We're at uh, the Grove Farmer's Market and we've come into uh, the veggie grill for lunch and all had salads. That doesn't happen very often. Oh, it's the house from Hocus Pocus, the Sanderson sisters house. This is so cool. So this is the house. <laughs> yeah, there's a please don't pick the berries around the other side. I'm Santa Monica Kia! So, Mum, do you care to tell the internet about Shack Attack? A Shack Attack? No, the pit is closed. 
No, we okay. Shaka Tag gone. We put fear is open. So last time when we came seven years ago, we drove up the bus drive. Was like there was a shark attack here. Seven last a uh, couple of weeks ago, there was a shark attack. Very bad. Beach was closed. Oh look, it's open again. Yeah, the beach. Beach now open. Beach Shark attack. Open. Then he goes. Oh yeah, beach open. Beach open. Shark attack. I mean, look at this. It's funny. It's freezing, we're on the beach from Santa Monica Beach and the sea is cold. There we go. We're off to Venice Beach now. So this is Venice Beach. So I've literally just said it's tattoo shops, tacky souvenir shops, and medical marijuana shops. And here's your perfect example. Tacky shop, tacky shop, tattoo shop, tacky shop, tacky shop. We've not got a wacky backy shop yet. Just yet. Stinks of weed. Oh, yeah, absolutely. I've just been sniffing to try and tell everybody else I'm the only one for some reason that knows what weed smells like. So I had to keep like, nope, can smell it. Smell it now. Stinks of it. Medical Madawara shop. Yeah. Yeah, there was a, a guy sat in a deck chair with a, a sign saying World's Happiest Junk and he was just sat there singing Jingle Bells, give me money. <laughs> it was funny. What? Give me your money because I'm only going to buy more beer. Yeah. This is honest. Venice Beach is lovely. All this going on. And then beautiful beach. And we'll turn around. And we've got a tacky shop, tattoo parlour, tacky shop, medical marijuana, and some palm trees. Smell that lovely, clean, fresh air. Now we're back in the car park. Yeah. <laughs> My lungs are a bit tight now. I think I've just smoked about ten things. You could, you could legit get high if you stood there long oh, enough. Yeah, I reckon. Yeah, definitely. And I bet it's probably quieter now. If we came earlier on it day when there's probably a lot more. The hazy. Yeah. Oh, it'd be great. Back to the bus. <laughs> 